on your way to the wonderful sunshine state of Florida, famous for its beautiful beaches, year-round sunshine, and of course, the magical Walt Disney World Resort. There's lots to see and do here, so sit back and relax as Mickey and his pal Goofy show us their all-time top 10 Walt Disney World favorites that you won't want to miss. To kick us off at number 10, we head to downtown Disney Westside. The area buzzes with excitement and is packed with shops, restaurants and entertainment, as well as the fantastic Disney Quest indoor interactive theme park. There's a range of nightclubs to party the night away. It's also home to the fantastic Cirque du Soleil show, La Nuba. All with different names, no Cirque du Soleil show around the world is the same. So downtown Disney is the only place you can see La Nuba. And with the amazing combination of acrobatics, artistry and stunning sets, you really do have to see it to believe it. No visit to Walt Disney World is complete without seeing your favorite characters on parade. So for number nine, here's your three must-sees. At the Magic Kingdom, fairy tale favorites come to life in the Share a Dream Come True Parade. And the whole jungle rumbles at Mickey's Jamming Jungle Parade at Disney's Animal Kingdom. And the wanted to be upstage, over at Disney Studios, the stars come out to play at Disney Stars of Motorcars Parade. Swooping in at number eight, it's the high-flying soaring in Epcot. Hold on tight as this hang-gliding adventure over the dramatic scenery of California really does take you to new heights. And diving to new depths. <laughs> oh, thanks for that, Goofy. There's always Disney's fun-filled sun-splashed water parks in at number seven. A wash with thrills and spills. They're the most imaginative on the planet. After an alpine meltdown, Disney's Blizzard Beach is home to Summit Plummet, one of the highest and fastest water slides on Earth. To you and me, that translates to 141 feet up and 60 miles per hour down. Over at Disney's Typhoon Lagoon, the latest attraction to make a splash is Crush and Gusher, sliding up, down and around with unexpected twists and hairpin turns every slide of the way. This water coaster will leave you breathless. You can always relax with a gentle float down the river or a quiet snooze in the sunshine. In fact, there's something for everyone and every age. And because each park is so dramatically different, you really have to experience them both. How else will you know which one's your favorite? Get your 3D glasses as we tune in to number six, Mickey's Philhar Magic at the Magic Kingdom Park. Listen and watch as Disney music meets Disney magic with a symphony of favorite Disney characters. Okay, Goofy, we're now at the halfway point of our countdown, so where are we off to now? Looks like somewhere scary. In fact, you look positively terrified. Ah, of course, it's Disney Studios and the Twilight Zone Tower of Terror. And the good news is, they've made it even scarier. As if falling 13 stories faster than the speed of gravity wasn't enough, with every ride now random, you never have the same fear twice. Survive that, and right next door is Rock and Roller Coaster, starring Aerosmith. At 0 to 60 miles per hour in 2.8 seconds, Fasten your seatbelts for a high-speed trip to the high-amp world of rock music. Ooh. Ah. Number four is the grand firework finales of the Disney theme parks. At Epcot, it's illuminations, reflections of Earth, a nighttime spectacular with the most amazing blend of fireworks, lasers, and digital wizardry ever. Over at Disney Studios, Sorcerer Mickey takes on the evil Disney villains in the spellbinding Phantasmic. Whilst the dazzling Wishes Show blazes high across the night sky above Cinderella Castle at Magic Kingdom Park.
number three, and what can you see, Goofy? Must be time to take a ride on Kilimanjaro Safaris at Disney's Animal Kingdom theme park. Through 110 acres of savanna, keep your eyes open and your camera ready. There's a variety of wild creatures to spot, including lions, giraffes, zebras, elephants, and hippos. This is Tower. Launch sequence engaged. For the penultimate must-see, it's the most technologically advanced ride ever at the Walt Disney World Resort, Mission Space. Experience liftoff, leave the Earth's gravitational pull behind and soar millions of miles through the solar system. Here at Epcot, the countdown is on, so get ready for blast-off on the wildest white-knuckle ride in the galaxy. Walt Disney World is already home to some of the highest mountains in Florida. The Magic Kingdom Mountains, where you hop aboard Big Thunder Mountain Railroad, blast off on Space Mountain, and plunge five stories on Splash Mountain. But now it's time to hold on to your mouse ears, as towering above them all, reaching the dizzy heights of number one, it's Expedition Everest, Legend of the Forbidden Mountain the colossal new adventure at Disney's Animal Kingdom theme park. Transported high to the Himalayas on a high-speed train, treacherous chasms and hairpin turns are just the start of the action. But try not to scream as you attract the attention of the mountain's guardian, the Yeti. In an instant, you're hurled forward and backwards into the abyss in a spiraling and terrifying 60-foot drop into the mountain. You see the beast. The trouble is, he sees you too. So now you know the top 10 must-sees. Thanks, Mickey and Goofy, for the guided tour. Now all that's left is for you to experience them for yourself when we touch down in Orlando. And remember, with four theme parks, two water parks and entertainment areas, there's something for everyone. To make sure you don't miss out on any of the fun, be sure to allow enough time to experience all the magic Walt Disney World has to offer. For those of you who already have your Disney tickets, you're set to head straight to the magic. But if you haven't got your tickets, don't worry, there's still time.